Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Hey girl, hey, how have you been? As you can see by my title, today I am back to share with you all the newest MAC collection, which you and I have both been waiting for. This is the MAC Boom Boom Bloom collection, which you already know by the time this video is out, is available for purchase at maccosmetics.com here in the States. This is one of those collections that I feel is released pretty much everywhere else, not really, but that's how it feels like everyone else gets it before us but it's okay i am obsessed i just got back from fashion week two days ago and the sun has graced this with its presence today so i said you know what i need to refilm this video because yesterday i filmed it wasn't looking all that cute so you know i'm all about that natural lighting and like i said it's meant to be so girl get your snacks ready can we just oh my gosh my second Girl, I just get ready, girl, because are you ready? I'm so ready for this. <laughs> if you are interested in seeing the brand new MAC Boom 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 collection, then keep on watching. The box packaging for the collection, which I am absolutely all about. I know you weren't asking, but I feel like this collection was like made for me. No, I'm kidding. My favorite flower is Sakura or Cherry Blossom, so girl you know i'm all about this if you love fix plus you can go through fix plus as fast as i do girl you need to get and then so before i show you all the products i do have to apologize because someone i'm not sure who <sighs> gave me two pink abus and the shade that i really 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 actually wanted because you all know i'm all, not all about that lip glass life i they're cute and occasionally I will wear them, but will I go out of my way? Oh my gosh, I need this in my life. No. I really wanted cherry mochi, and I got two pink boots instead. So I do apologize about that. You know I'm not the biggest fan of lip glasses, but it is what it is. If you follow me on my social media, I'm not trying to shout myself out, but here we go. Please follow me on my social media, Twitter, Snapchat, Instagram. It's at Macaholic. It's a zero, not an O. I will be posting pictures in the daylight, hopefully with the natural lighting, and hopefully you all get a better representation of what they look like. But again, thank you so much to the sun for pulling through. Let me show you all the products, do a little quick eye demo, the swatches, and I'll be back. This is the eyeshadow times nine. Girl, look at this packaging. You know I'm all about this. This is eyeshadow times nine, and it is called Kabuki Dog. Girl, living. This one is called Floreal how stunning this looks it's like an ombre but i'm pretty sure once i swatch it it's not gonna be all that but let's wait let's wait spring bling i'm all about those golds this is all me oh my gosh this first one is called for the frill of it again look at that packaging it's stunning and the second one more of the pink is called pinkaboo and the next shade is called Heart Melter. Next we have the 5 lipsticks. Girl, you already know I'm all about this bullet. This packaging is just everything. First lipstick is a cream sheen finish and it is called Hey Kiss Me. This is giving me Bianca B flashbacks <laughs> it's not as bad it's definitely a pink for all my fair gals i mean like i always say girl how many times do i say it in every collection videos always do you boo boo but this is definitely not for me i want to move you all because i feel like it's not bright enough but girl if i'm moving here it's just a little, little too bright it is a cream sheen finish it goes on really really nicely it is very pigmented it's a turl Really nice soft pink. Again, not my favorite. I don't think it looks horrible per se. Maybe with this top, but when am I ever going to wear this top again? Like, let's be honest. <laughs> Maybe for another YouTube video in a couple years. But it's okay. This one, more of a peach pink. This one is called Fruit Teas. As always, these are one application on my lips and not my favorite. These types of colors are definitely not my favorite, but I don't think it looks awful on me. So 
Also in matte finish is called Tisk Tisk. Girl, all of a sudden. It's a really bright, really bright pink. I'm not mad at it. I'm not mad at it. It's not, it, it does give me those Kenny Yum Yum vibes. It's a really nice pink. Also a matte finish is called a Framboise Moy. I'm so excited about this. Oh my gosh. Look how nicely this one applies. I love this color. Just wrap it up. I love this color. You need this color in your life. Giving me, I think it's Snow Orchard or Show Orchard. I can't remember the name, but it's kind of giving me those vibes. It's really, really nice color. Girl, you absolutely need this color. Go get it. Go get it. You don't even have to watch the rest of the video. Just go get this lipstick. It is so bomb. This is giving me... Oh, I love this pop of color on my lips. Girl, I absolutely love it. Go get it. Go get it. Go get it. I really shouldn't have used this color all over the lid. I did the same thing yesterday. I'm going to go ahead and take this shade right here. Really, like I said, simple, everyday, you know me type of look. And to be honest, I'm actually really, really surprised with this eyeshadow timeline. I'll probably say it again in the outro when I'm saying, you know, my final recommendations and all that. I'm really, really surprised in a good way with this palette. It's very nicely pigmented, even swatched on my arm. It's just all of the colors just went like very nicely. I'm not saying they're the most pigmented shadows ever. But the fact that they show up nicely on my arm just speaks millions. This color for all over the lid. I'm just going to use my finger. You already know how I go. Look at this shade. I'm living. Look. Oh my gosh. Kyoto Kitty. It's really nice. Okay, there it's getting a little bit brighter. I'm just gonna deepen up the crease using this color right here. Kabuki doll. I'm just gonna deepen up the crease here, give my eyes some depth. All right, I'm just going to go ahead and put on some liner. Those are the pictures and swatches for the brand new and limited edition MAC Boom Boom Bloom collection. As always, girl, I know, I already know you all snatched something up. So let me know what you picked out down below. Above everything, I always say this, which, uh, you know, I always say a lot of things. But makeup collector at heart. I love makeup. I do apply on makeup on an everyday basis, but your girl a look and snatch like this 24-7. That's just, it's not going to happen. So... For me, this was just collector's paradise. I'm just all about this and the fact that I love Sakura. It's just, 
I love it, girl. What products do I recommend? Do you absolutely need? Get what you feel that you're going to use. If you're a collector like me, and I'm not going to say, I was going to say get it all, but everything about this collection is just, I love it. I'm just so happy with it. Absolutely love the Cherry Blossom Fix Plus. If you love Fix Plus as much as I do, you need to go get this. It is so refreshing, but it's not for everyone. It does have a sweet smell. It's not, I mean, I don't want to say per se it's more florally. It's definitely more sweet. So if you're not really into those types of scents, then but I personally really, really love it. I go through Fix Plus like crazy, so I definitely recommend you all checking it out. Grabbing a couple backups like your girl is going to do. So I'm definitely going to stock up on this. The product that I was most surprised by and that I really recommend. I mean, the highlight powders are really nice, but here we go with this overlay. Whatever. I'll Mac. If it wasn't for me being a collector, I would just be like, meh, and on to the next. But I actually really, really like Spring Bling. Yes, there's the overlay, and here's the actual product. It's actually a very nice product. It goes on pretty sheer, but I feel like it can give your face that little bit of color, at least the color that I need. So I really, really actually like this. Ooh, this sun. It's not for everyone. I know a lot of people just wanted the color, you know, the overspray. And I feel you. That this is like marine life all over again. Not as bad because that one was gorgeous. But I really, really like this powder. I'm surprised to say, but I actually do like this one, the pink one. I'm sorry, I got sidetracked. The product that I'm most impressed with and I'm actually kind of really shook aside from this lipstick because you need this lipstick is the eyeshadow times nine i'm actually really surprised in a good way those swatches i always tell you all the swatches for me are a really good indicator of how they're gonna look like on my eyes yesterday when i first swatched them i was like mac finally like really i was just really surprised in a good way like yes finally mac there's an eyeshadow times nine or eyeshadow palette that is just pigmented from the get-go. Max shadows are hit or miss, but I actually really, really like this one. I really do recommend it. I feel like this is perfect for, every I always say this, but it is. It's perfect for every day. You can deepen it up for a night look. I love this. I recommend it. I'm actually going to grab a couple because I have a couple birthdays coming up in May. I know that, I mean, it's February now, but girl, it, it's, it'll be here before I know it. So I'm actually going to grab a couple when this actually launches. I'm very, very surprised in a good way about this. So if you're kind of debating on the times nine, I do recommend going for it because you can use all the shadows. They all show up really nicely. I'm just shook. Shook in a good way. I'm like, finally, Mac is pulling through. I love this and I recommend it. So my top three products for sure, I have to say, this gorgeous lipstick right here, girl. Look at this shade. And tell me I don't need that. Because girl, you need This is going to be perfect for every day. Date night, girl night, you night. Every day. It's so gorgeous. I absolutely, oh my gosh, just look at, whoo, girl, I love it. I love it. The lip glasses, I'm not a really big fan of. Again, I am sorry about not having cherry mochi. Someone played me, but it's okay. Overall, I'm very impressed with the collection. Yes, the lipsticks could have been a little bit better, but I feel like, again, this collection was geared more towards the Asia market, which is fine. I mean, I still love it because I love Sakura and I'm all about that life. But definitely Fix Plus. Check it out if you love Fix Plus. Check out this eyeshadow times nine. This eyeshadow palette is bomb. Kyoto Doll is freaking bomb AF. I love this shade. This could have been the Lunar New Year collection and I would not have been mad. Let's be honest. So I really, really like that. You know, this isn't going to be everyone's cup of tea for sure, but I do actually like the highlight powder. It's just me and the lipstick girl. You need the lipstick. I mean, at least get one. You're going to at least get one just for collecting. You know, you know you are. So just get this one. I can't even say the name, but just get this one because... <laughs> loves thank you all so so much for watching i really hope this video is informational i really really want to give a big big thank you to the sun 
you the real VIP there because of for pulling through with my natural lighting today. So I hope this video was informational. Please follow me on my social media. That's a new one. You haven't heard that from me before, huh? In a while, huh? Follow me on my social media, Twitter, Snapchat, Instagram. It's at Macaholic with a zero, not an O. Definitely check me out there. I will be posting more pictures. As always, girl, you know the drill before you leave. Don't forget to leave this video a huge thumbs up for me if you found it helpful. I would really, really appreciate it. Even if you don't have the time to comment, but if you do have a little time to comment, girl, let me know the deets down below. And I always say this, I don't know in what other way I can say it, but don't forget to leave without clicking that red subscribe button for me. Please join the fam. Like, we already closed, so just take the next big step. Don't forget to turn on that little notification bell next to the subscription box, which will notify you as soon as your girl uploads because you know my schedule. Well, you know about it. <laughs> That's all we pretty much know is that there is no schedule girl that's probably all we know thank you all so so much for spending a little bit of your day with me i hope you all enjoy the rest of your day go out and get it girl i love you all so much as always and i'll see you all next time bye everyone